I'm getting ready to buff it out. I'm using Real Techniques by um, Pixie Woo's collection. Um, give you a tip when you're using liquid products. If you take a rag, don't spritz any water or anything onto your brush. Take a rag and just kind of go like this a little, a few times, you know, like back and forth, just enough to where it feels just tad bit like it's been, you know, crossed against the thing. You know, kind of go like this on your hand. Now start your buffing. And that'll keep product from getting up in here that will be wasted and it'll keep it spreading it evenly across your face. And all we're doing is kind of buffing everything out. So we're just kind of doing like almost like a sketching mood move. Now I got something to get up under my eyes, so I'll get that spot in a minute. But for right now, close your eyes and just kind of buff and sketch, almost like the sketching motion I was telling you, back and forth. I'm going to be doing quite a bit of series about foundation, correctors, concealers, you know, doing it and applying it different ways with different, ap applying it with like a sponge tip, um, the brush, um, use your hands, you know, just showing you the different ways you can do it. And if you're kind of sketching this and kind of moving this around, you're kind of getting it all up into the areas where it won't look so fake. And I know if right now this is looking really, um, really white, but I went with a shade that's very close to uh, my skin, but maybe a shade too off, one to shoot two shades off. And I'll tell you why, because when I get done putting my makeup on, and the way I highlight and contour, um, it will actually be a blessing. <laughs> so that's why I always go with the lightest first. Take what's left, kind of drag it down. Also, when you get done, then kind of run back over your, your brush again. And you'll see I didn't have a lot of waste on that rag. And this is a white rag. Okay, I'm going to now buff up into the corners here with the uh, Elizabeth Arden, that uh, buffing thing, like a beauty blender. And this thing does awesome job. It's easy to keep clean. Kind of look up and kind of give a sketch back and forth. Kind of twirl it like that. And it just gives an awesome finish look. And I haven't even put my powder on yet. I'm just doing this to kind of, um, you know, blend the rest of the liquid foundation and the um, concealer and corrector blended in. And that way it doesn't tug on there, but it blends the rest of it in there. And then you could do right over top of the rag as well. Um, make sure to keep all your, your things clean, your brushes, your tips, all that.